The solstice marked the beginning of the new year and signified the one-month countdown to the Panhellenic Games, something even death couldn't quell the soul's excitement for. With such an important celebration at hand, Persephone had asked Hades if they could host a party at the palace, to which he had agreed. She was looking forward to having the souls in the halls again, just as much as they were looking forward to being there. By the time Persephone returned to the palace, she still felt unsettled. The darkness of her doubt swelled, pressing against her skull, and her magic pulsed beneath her skin, making her feel achy and exhausted. She rang for tea and wandered into the library, hoping that reading would take her mind off her conversation with Yuri. Curling into one of the large chairs near the fireplace, Persephone leafed through Hecate's copy of Witchcraft and Mayhem. It was one of several assignments from the goddess of magic, who was helping her learn to control her erratic power. It wasn't working as fast as she hoped. Persephone had waited a long time for her powers to manifest, and when they did, it had been during a heated argument with Hades. Since then, she had managed to make flowers bloom, but had trouble channeling the appropriate amount of magic. She had also discovered her ability to teleport was glitchy, which meant she didn't always end up where she intended. Hecate said it was just a matter of practice, but it still made her feel like a failure. And it was for these reasons she decided not to use magic in the upper world. Not until she got it under control. So, in preparation for her first lesson with Hecate, she studied, learning the history of magic, alchemy, and the diverse and terrifying powers of the gods, yearning for the day when she could use her power as easily as she breathed. <laughs>